Good afternoon and welcome to Manchester. We have a big game coming for you today. We've got uh, the Tamworth Phoenix visiting Manchester Titans. Just waiting on the towing costs. Free game, coin toss, money. What are your thoughts so far? What are you thinking? Uh, I think if uh, if Manchester win the uh, the toss, we'll probably defer the reception, take it in the second half. Predictions on score? No way. <laughs> Not a chance I'm calling that. <laughs> no predictions on score, but I reckon expectations today. Two top teams of the North going head to head. Uh, first time they've seen each other since 2019, I believe. So a few scores to settle out there. A few old rivalries as well. Should be a good game of football. Not sure what the hold up with the air. I'm sure will be happening any minute now. While we are uh, holding things up for a second here, it's a good uh, good chance to have a look at that Titans tide. Have a look at that Tamworth side as well. Uh, some interesting cleat choices as well. Uh, see some bright golds. See some brand new Jordans, which I'm aware of. A uh, bit difficult. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bit difficult to see them over the other side for the Tamworth team. Uh, hopefully I'll get an update by uh, half time. I'm sure clean the justice taste. While we're getting underway, it's probably a good chance to uh, have a few messages from the Titan sponsors today. Uh, we've got the Home Improvement Group serving thousands of customers with their home transformation dreams. From doors and windows, conservatories, roof gardens and beyond, the Home Improvement Group is for you. Just looking at some feedback of some interference on the mics. Uh, we're just checking for wind uh, right now. Uh, we'll have an update on the wind speeds for you in one second. It's a surprise it's not rain here in Manchester.
Okay, ref check. Looks like we're just about ready to get uh, the coin toss underway. That'll be coming up next. We've got a full seven-man crew today. It's a bit of a shock for Brit Ball. Although we do appreciate it. All the hard work that the officials put in. And the captains make their way out for the coin toss. like fans have won the toss. They're going to defer the call. to keep an eye out for today so based on the cleat check from previously uh, number 95 Leon Phillip defensive tackle for the Titans uh, sporting some brand new wheels today in the Jordans uh, be looking forward to seeing him take the field also number nine Sam Fossey as well uh, GB safety who uh, missed last week's game so this will be the first time we get to have a look at him um, but yeah any for you uh, I think I'm gonna probably keep my eye on uh, Max Gracie Ainscuff uh, incredible player, built different. Uh, he plays out at wide receiver, so uh, we'll see if Sam Bloomfield can get the ball to him.
And we have Aaron Bocock with for Manchester. Let's get this game. Again, two of the best teams in the in the north of the country against each other. Good chance that uh, one of them may even make it to the Britball final. We'll have to see come the end of the season. Game one for Tamworth, game two for Manchester. We'll see what happens. And we're off. A reception and a switch to the other side. Excuse me. He's still not got further though. And the tackle out into bounds. Yeah, it's a big return straight up there. And it's going to be first down at 35. Let's see what Tamworth can do with the ball. Yeah, that's number three there behind centre. That's uh, Angus Cook, uh, QB in today for Tamworth Phoenix. Uh, let's get a good look at him today. And that's a run inside. And he's taken down. He made about five yards, four yards, I think. A generous four, yeah. Uh, the rest put it down at three. We'll go to uh, second and seven. And second down. Ball snap, it's a handoff, it's a run left. Uh, for one and a half, fish yard. And the ball is stopped, and it looks like going to run from the QB. That's the first down, but not much more. First down at the 33. That's a ball snap, it's hand off left. For a gain of about eight yards. Strong run in there. Watch out for your knees today though, that was Alex Cooper on the very low tackle there. Ball is snapped, it's another handoff left. And tackle into out of bounds. Flag down. There's a flag down.
think it's going to be for Holden. And second and 11, second and 12. That's a pass out right. It's closed down and it doesn't complete. Well, we're going to third and 12 now. It's going to be a long one to reach this. We'll see what they do. people at the stadium today nice crowd big crowd today and that's a snap for the third down he takes the pass he shoots and it's a drop incomplete that'll take us to fourth down looks like special teams coming on probably a punt situation i doubt we're going to be kicking this for a field goal And they're set up for punt. And that's out. That's out of about 13. Now for Manchester to have a chance to move the ball upfield, hopefully get some points. Yeah, first look at Sam Bloomfield in this offense now. Uh, Sam obviously uh, recently called up to GB. We've got some stars on that line as well. Yeah, some real stars out there. Keep an eye on Adam Bamba in at number zero. A new addition to Brick Ball this year as well. That's him, that's Adam. He looks to have made a couple of yards there. Gain of about two, I'd say, yeah. And um, we have second and uh, eight. It's a handoff to Joe Nicholson down the middle for a couple of hard yards there. Pulling out third and about five. See what the Titans can do with the ball here. And that's the ball snapped. Sam's looking for the pass. And he runs up the middle. Keeps the ball secure, but unfortunately couldn't get a play away. Titans bring out their punt team. And that punt's gone up high. Straight out of bounds. That was a one-handed catch by Scott Tomlinson on the sideline there. Impressive from a middle linebacker. And the, uh, the 
cheering, the particularly high-pitched cheering you can hear is the uh, Manchester ladies team, uh, who Scott is one of the coaches of. First down at the 35. The ball is snapped to Angus. He hands it off and it's a run through the middle. And he's tackled for a gain of about eight yards. Second down, two. Ball is snapped, handed off through the middle. And he is held up by a strong defensive line. No gain now. Fantastic tackle there by Mark Horton and Connor Hewitt. And we have a man down. It's 95, Leon Phillip there. Hopefully Leon's going to be okay here. Captain of the D-line. He's on his feet. He's a great sign. I'm sure he will, he's tough. Replacing him at uh, three tech there is number 44, that's Alfred Mazengarezo. It's a pass, and it's intercepted from Manchester! What a catch! Fantastic from the Manchester defence there. That was Unfortunate an absolutely for Angus amazing Cook. pick there. Fingertip stuff. Leapt like a salmon. And his tradition with the Manchester defence, he will get to wear the turnover chain. Fantastic profile picture opportunity. The uh, interception there caught by Alex Eager, formerly of Merseyside Knighthood, transferred to Manchester Titans. Absolutely fantastic player in the safety position. He travelled all the way from Liverpool to make that pick. And here we have the Manchester offence back out with a pass out to Adam Bambury. He collects that and he's through. He makes it to the 30 and that's the first down. Fantastic reception there. In of a team, would you say, Manny? Yeah, something like that. And another first down for Manchester. A motion from Chris Winrow. Ball's come out to Sam. He's going to look for the pass. Oh, very close to a reception for Chris Winrow there. I'd say almost in field goal position. Uh, maybe a little bit more um, to be comfortable there. Could see some points, first points of the day. 
We'll see where the drive goes. Another motion from Winrow. And the ball is snapped. It's handed off to Joe Nicholson, who goes running. Fantastic run by Joe, making about nine yards there. Yeah, this run game really, really rolls off the back of Joe Nicholson. Uh, another GB star in this Titans lineup as well. We'll see what Manchester can do on this third and short. The ball snapped, and it's a low snap, but Sam managed to pick it up, and he's going to rush forward. Can he make the yards? It looks like he's possibly made about one yard there. Could be a knee down just short, I'd say. Yeah, I think he's short of the first. Fantastic awareness from him following the low snap. And it looks like Aaron Bocott has not come onto the field. Manchester will go for it on fourth down. They need a yard to make. I'm thinking probably a handoff to Joe Nicholson here. With hard yards. That's exactly what happened. And he's made that first down. Fantastic running. Short yardage where it counts. However, great read from the Tamworth defence there. Fresh set of downs for Manchester here in the red zone. Another motion for Chris Rinro. And the ball is snapped. Sam heads to his right. It's an incomplete pass. And the refs haven't blown it dead. It would seem that the refs are uh, saying that that wasn't a pass. And that'll, and be that'll be an incompletion. <laughs> that is the Tamworth defence that we do expect, though, not switching off until that whistle goes. It's what you come to expect to see from a team such as Tamworth. Second and ten. And 13. Oh. And the flag has come in there from the, uh, the referee. It's like a very early hit as the ball was in the air. And there's no flag on the play. The ball ended up going pretty deep at the end zone. I think I'm going to there, calling that uncatchable. Third and ten, Joe Nick's motion into tight end position. It looks like a delay of game penalty. So we have third and 15 here. The Tamworth have really taken this thing out of this momentum from Manchester Titans. Tam Bloomfield takes, throws the pass deep. Ooh. 
That was close. Great coverage from the Tamworth defence. As Titans field goal come onto the field. ball is snap kick is not good I'm sure Manchester will be d disappointed coming off that drive without any points I'm just cooking the two-back set again. Now it's a handoff and a run down the middle. First down and some change there. Good open field tackle from Manchester, but fantastic running from Tamworth. Got a first and ten at about 32. The ball is snapped and it's handed off again. And he's still going. He's still going. He's taken down at around halfway. Yeah, just what? One yard shot that halfway line there. Probably about four, three more to go. We have second and four from Tamworth. And the ball is snapped, it's handed off again for a run down the middle, and he's taken down. Taken down on the halfway line. And there was a timeout from Manchester in order to make a, a little change in personnel bringing off Alex Cooper and putting on Jack Watson, formerly of uh, Lancashire Wolverines. Here we have third and three from Tamworth. And it's a off and run round. Yeah, very consistent, very methodical with these inside runs from Tamworth. Fresh set of downs, first and ten, around the 35, Tamworth. And it's a handoff and a run to the outside. Manchester looking to chase that down. Good pressure from the defensive line.
Second on long from Tamworth here now. This ball's handed off with a run down the middle. Big tackle game of about four yards, maybe three. Third down now, third and long. What are we going to see, Manning? Thinking they'll go for a pass, but they've been very run heavy today. It's been good. It's been working for him so far. Yeah, it's been working fantastically for him, breaking those first tackles. Bad stop. There's flags everywhere. Big tackles into Angus Cut there. Fourth and eleven special teams are up. Fair catch call from Manchester, smart choice. It does pin them very deep though. Yeah, especially when you got ten Tamworth players running full steam. You know, it's about five, six to the ball by the time it was caught. Yeah, I'd call a fair catch too. <laughs> Manchester pinned very deep now by Tamworth. Let's see if they can uh, move the field, move the ball up the field. See if Tamworth can stop them. The ball snapped out and it's a handoff to Joe Nicholson who makes the run, misses the first tackle, fumbles the ball. Looks like it's picked up though by, uh, I think Manchester picked that up. Ball picked up there by Corey Dare. No man down, looks like Joe Nicholson. He sat up straight which is always a good sign. It's very Undertaker-esque, that. And he's on his feet, which is a fantastic sign. I know he struggled a lot with uh, injuries, Joe Nicholson. So uh, to see him up and jogging, that's good. Ball snapped, and it's a uh, shovel to the outside to John Gago. 
Yeah, I don't think there's any gain on that one. Yeah, gain is zero. Take the third down for Manchester. Snap looks like a pass from Sam Bloomfield. He manages to escape the sack and throws the ball. Oh, that's a drop. He won't be happy with himself there, Max. We have a Tamworth player down as well now. Another player down. Can't quite make the number out. Trying to find out the gentleman's name. Can you see that number on that money? I haven't got my readers on. Ah, it's 91. I believe his name's Arthur Byrne. Manchester looking like they're going to try and play some football with 10 men there. Whoa. And the ball pointed out, pointed out there to about the... Uh, 34. Some of these markers on the pitch make it very difficult to tell uh, how many yards. Great starting position here for Tamworth. First and ten out of thirty two. And that's a handoff. Uh, he looks to be held up. Possibly gain of a yard. Could be one with full momentum there. And the ball snapped for the second down. It's a handoff left. Missing tackles. Fantastic run in there. Great running. Diving. Take a short break for another player down on the town west side now. End of quarter one. Very cagey first quarter with a few breakout plays from both sides. Uh, seems still too tight to call this one. Remains scoreless. Good to see Leon Phillip back on the pitch. First and 10 from 13. 
well snap to Angus, it's a pass. Oh, pass to no man's land. Almost another interception from Alex Eager. Second and ten from the 13. It's a ball snap that's handed off for another run. And they hold up. Possibly a yard there game for Tamworth, maybe two. Third and seven, Tamworth, very strong position in the uh, red zone. That's another pass. Oh, almost a reception there. Unfortunate not to get the grab. That'll bring out the special teams for the field goal. Could be the first points of today. Snap, but the refs have blown it. A delayed game penalty and a turnover. Maybe no, 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 no. No idea. The refs blew for something. Ball snap, it's a low snap, but it looks like a good kick. Let's see what the refs have to say. And it's good. 3 0 Tamworth. Ignore the uh, the uh, physical scoreboard there. So we'll get that sorted out now. Still struggling to sort out the scoreboard. At least the digital one's correct. <laughs> uh, 
and we have a correct scoreboard here in Manchester. And the kickoff return. It's taken down around the uh, 13. Return there by uh, I'm not sure. Max Gracie Ainscuff, I think. Titans offense out. That's a handoff down the middle. Very strong run in there. Didn't make a load of yards though. Looking for the pass from Sam Bluefield. That's a completion. <laughs> Complete to Max Gracie Ainscuff. I think that's the first passing play of the day that's been uh, that's been received actually. <laughs> Brit ball. Fresh set of downs. And the ball's outside to Max again. Who breaks a couple of tackles. Looks to be sh just short of the first down. There was a flag on that play. We're coming all the way back. Refs liked it, they asked for them to do it again, I think. Not sure on what the call there was from the refs, Mr. Signal. Inside run from Manchester, not making very many yards there. Going to need more than that. It's like Sam's looking for another pass and he's gone deep. Oh! Man was open, pass was too long. Looking for Adam Bamber on the deep ball there. Touchdown scored last season. Fantastic receiver. Third and long here for Sam Bloomfield. It's a pass out to Max. Can Max make these yards? He's keeping going. He's still going, still on his feet. Can they drive him over? It looks like they've possibly just made the first down there. What, what a pass, what a catch. And they're moving the chains. And there's Chase are moving. That's grit right there on a Sunday afternoon. Manchester will be very happy to see that. <laughs> Fresh center down for Manchester. The ball is snapped. Looks like to be a pass out right. And a flag on the flag side. on the near side. It 
looks to be a player's box infraction. No loss of yardage there for uh, Titans. And he's looking deep for Max. Oh, flags Flag are out there, all over him. And that's going to march Manchester right up the field. All spotted on around about the 17 now. And that's a middle run from uh, Manchester. A bit of extra help from the uh, QB. Joe Nicholson coming back onto the field. Great sign. Just for his own sake, following the injuries he's had and the struggles he's had with those injuries. First time playing football again for uh, probably about three or four years. And the ball's handed off to Joe Nicholson for a middle run. A uh, little hurdle from the uh, Thomas DB there. Felt like the Grand National for a second there. I think Manchester should call a timeout here. Great quick opportunity to talk about one of our sponsors here. Synergy Direct is the UK's leading renewable gen energy installer, specialising in the design and installation of solar panels, battery storage, and air source heat pumps. Thank you very much, Synergy Direct. Really appreciate it. First in goal at the 10. Oh, wait, no, it's not.
I think we're on fourth down here. That's an interception from Tamworth, and he's got hold of the ball. He's, he's taken down by Adam Bamba. Tamworth will be very happy with the result of that drive. What a catch there. And there's a flag on the near side. It looks like he's going to keep going for a loss. Offset penalties. I believe it was an offside and maybe a holding. That's a free play for Tamworth and he's thrown it deep and uh, it's incomplete. Really eager to get out the blocks there by some of the uh, Titans linebackers coming up the middle for the blitz. Got to have better discipline than that. It's going to be a five yard penalty and a repeat first down. And the first and five here from Tamworth. Very twitchy up front, both offensive line and defensive line really uh, looking to get out here. That'll be a false start though from Tamworth or marching back five. And we go back again. Let's just start out with a uh, first and ten. We'll just ignore two plays. And it looks like to be a run left. Looks like he's tackled for a gain of about two or three yards. Ah. Strong run in the end. Yeah, you can tell with the run play from uh, both teams today, there's a lot of extra effort being put in, even after, after contact there. Every single yard is counting today.
Must have gained about four yards on that on that run. Second and six. Ball is snapped. Angus is looking for a pass. That's a completion for Angus. Great pass, great catch. Fresh out of downs. They're at the 29. Oh, and it's a fumbled snap from Angus. He's going to pick it up and run with it. Scraping down the edge there from Cade Makin on the left end. Uh, edge, rusher, edge, edge rusher for GB. Second and 12, looking for a pass, and it's thrown out. Ooh. Looked to be up for grabs for both players. He made a decent attempt. Third and long here with about 12 yards to go for Tamworth. See what they can do with the ball. And it looks to be uh, keeping hold of it. And made probably a yard. On the third down, it's uh, not much use in this sort of field position. Tamworth thought to have called time out there. Fourth and 11, the special teams are out. It was a timeout, so uh, we'll see what Tom decide to do with the ball there. Yeah, and it's a punt. Well, that was a drop, but it uh, looks like Manchester seem to have recovered it. Risky business there from Manchester's returners. Time to have another look at Sam Bloomfield and this Titans offense. Let's get something together. Perhaps this drive. Been a very cagey match so far. Uh, 
A pass out to uh, Adam Bamba, who's making some extra yards after the catch. He's still on his feet. Fantastic run in there. After a uh, solid passing catch. Makes a change from the, uh, the doink before. Tamworth player still down in the middle of the field. He's back on his feet, walking off. Always good to see. Gentleman, uh, Johnny. Good to see him back on his feet, making his way to the sideline. First and ten from Manchester with a handoff to Joe Nicholson. Great running to get the extra yards there. Looks to have taken it at about five. Yeah, it's great to see the uh, Tamworth one game working so well for him, punching holes through that Manchester defence. Only for Manchester to do the exact same back to them on their run game. It looks like to be a pass deep from Sam Bloomfield here. And that's incomplete. Double covered there. Throwing way into traffic deep there. Third and five here. Must be a jet sweep with a big cut block from the running back. Excellent yards after the after the contact there. Takes it to a first down for Manchester. Just shy of the twenty yard line. And first down for Manchester, it's another handoff to Joe Nicholson. That looks to be a fun one, I think Tamworth would pick that up. I'll have to see what the ref has to say here. I think the conversation will be now. Did he have a knee down? Tamworth have turned the ball over. Great work from Tamworth there to force the fumble and pick it up. What a recovery as well. I mean, that was a dog pile by the end of it. I'm sure Manchester will be very unhappy to have lost the ball out in that sort of field position.
very in-depth conversation going on here between the officials and uh, Luke Carlton, the Titans defensive coordinator. Seems to be unhappy about something. And on the left, we can see uh, Jonathan Homer, the head coach of the Titans. First down for uh, Tampa on this drive. Looks fungus. He throws it out. And again, about. Yeah, swing pass out to the left there. Um, was able to pick up some decent yardage before he was taken out. And looks to be a pass out and a completion. And another flag down. I think the flag was thrown for a late hit, possibly. And the flag has been waved off. No flag on the play. Great reception there. Great throw there by Angus as well. Some very important yardage there for uh, Tamworth. Down from Tamworth. And it looks to be a first down. Well, maybe short. Just eking over for a first down. Chains moving now. No. Yeah, chains have moved. Strong drive here from Tamworth, forcing their, forcing their way downfield. And that's a run down the middle. It's wide open space, untouched through the middle of the line. Another first down here for Tamworth. Very good drive from Tamworth. Looking very dangerous right now. Another set of fresh downs here for Angus. Ah, oh. well, it's being complete. Big pressure there on the right end. Uh, that's uh, Joe Partington there, really in Angus's face there. Hard to tell with the uh, number of bodies the Titans plays, but uh, I don't think you've gained any yards there. Possibly one. Yeah, uh, looks like we're going to third and ten.
going to be third and ten from Tamworth here. Ball snapped and run inside. He's still going. And the rest is blowing it. Doesn't look to have made the first down. Looks like Tamworth are going for it on fourth down here. Fourth and short, yeah, great field position here. And the ball is snapped out, and here comes Joe Partington. He's looking to keep hold of him. And pressure again from that right end of the edge rusher, Joe Partington. Joe Partington, fantastic play. Unfortunate to miss out on GB. Uh, seemed to be more of a scheme issue um, due to the position he plays. Not used to that uh, three front end, more of an edge rusher. Strong resilience from the Manchester defence there. Surely won't be happy about most of the drive, but uh, towards the end there, they uh, really held their own. And the ball snapped to Sam Bloomfield, it takes the pass down to Chris Winrow. And it's a drop that, it was in his hands. He'll be very unhappy with that. Passes out, and it's completed to Max Grace Ainsworth. Oh, and it looks to be a fumble again. And there is one of the referees is signaling strong that he was down. Manchester looked to have kept hold of the ball there. Fortunate or unfortunate call, I'm not sure. Yeah, he looked like he got a knee down from here. Yeah, given how strong the, uh, the ref was pointing in the direction, it seems like he was uh, convinced that that was down. I actually had my eyes closed, but the ref's convinced me. Fresh set of downs for Manchester. Completion from Chris Rinrow. Was it complete? He looks to have got his feet in there, yeah. Double toe tap. I thought it looked like uh, DeAndre Hopkins sort of thing. Uh, if we had the other angles, it'd be... Uh, be able to tell. You can just take our word for that. Truck inside there for the first down by Joe Nicholson. Strong runner of the ball. Manchester going very quick now. Ball deep to no one, possibly look Bamba, but nowhere to be found.
Second and ten for the Titans. Ball snap. Sambo. Pass. Completed to Chris on the floor. Stringing some, uh, stringing some plays together here, the Titans. Back they go, they're in the 20 yard line now. Just outside of it. Take a short break between plays here to mention another one of our kit sponsors here at Manchester Titans. SWS are a complete package when it comes to green technologies, offering a range of services for home and commercial renewable installations, including air source, solar panels, battery storage systems, and electric vehicle charging points. Thank you very much, SWS. Manchester, third and uh, first and ten from the 21. The ball snapped to Sam Bloomfield. He's looking for a pass. He gets rid of the man. He's going to take the yards. That's a tripping flag. Very dirty play. That'll be a personal foul, foul and that will walk uh, Manchester downfield. Put them in a much stronger position than they were a second ago. Ball snapped to Sam. And he looking for the corner. The refs have called it incomplete. And that looks to be the end of the half. Very unfortunate there for Manchester not to get the points at the end. Thank you for joining us here in uh, sunny Manchester, as always. Uh, and we'll be back for the second half in around 15 minutes.
Hey, check it. Hey, check it. Put the place up. And we're back here for the second half football between Manchester Titans and the Tamworth Phoenix. The current score is 3-0 to Tamworth. Very low scoring game today. Strong, strong showing from both defences here. Hope to see uh, a bit more of the uh, offensive side of things in the second half. See uh, if we can uh, string some plays together. Get a score out of either of the teams. Yeah, it really is a case of who's going to blink first here. Uh, both defensive units looking really, really strong, particularly in that goal line red zone defense. So first to blink, really, first to, first to make a mistake, and we're going to see some scores. It's what we're all here for. We all want to see touchdowns. Come the match. First down of the second half is going to be taken from the 29 yard line. Ball snapped to Sam Bloomfield. Takes the pass out right. Max Gracie Ainscuff looking to make up about nine yards there. Second and short. Less than a yard to get for Manchester. And that's the ball snap. And it's handed off to Joe Nicholson. He makes that extra yard. And a couple more. Four start bounds.
times with a fresh set of downs. Adam Bamber on the motion. Sam Bluefield fakes the throw after the handoff. Another inside run from, I think, Joe Nicholson. It'll pick up about three there. Looks like to be a gain of two. Second and eight. Another motion from Adam Bamba. The ball snapped out. He looks for the ball to Max Gracie Ains. Cuff. And he's through, and that looks to be a touchdown for Manchester Titans. First touchdown of the day. First drive for Titans. They're loving it. The crowd are going insane. It's well, been a long time coming today. <laughs> that's what we came to see today, and it took almost three quarters for us to get that. Looks like Manchester on a mission this second half. Everything being done with absolute purpose here. Pass from Sam Bloomfield out to number 13, Max Gracie Ainscuff. Yeah, Sam Bloomfield there with a great quick pass. Uh, let's not forget that stateside sponsorship uh, he's picked up this season. For all your signed NFL memorabilia, source shipped and supplied, that's stateside. Yeah, Sam Bloomfield's personal sponsor there. And that looks to be a good kick. That'll be 7 3 to the Manchester Titans. Manchester have taken the lead. And the cheer from the crowd was for our scoreboard guy, uh, DK. He managed to get the score correct this time. Yeah, really great work there from DK to um, Really struggled in the first half to get that right. Seems his coach has had a word with him at half time. And it looks like the ball has blown over as the kick was happening. <laughs> I think we'll just go for another kick there. Well, you see it all today, don't you? <laughs> And the Aaron Bocock. Two gone through about 15. And um, looks like Tamworth are asking for a re-kick as the kick went straight out of bounds. Quite an interesting beginning to this uh, second half. We've had a uh, touchdown already, and this will be the third attempt at kickoff after that score. Brit ball. That's a longer kick there from uh, Aaron Brokop, and they fake the handoff. He looks to still be going. He's chase being chased down by. Oh, it's a touchdown from Tamworth. Incredible kickoff return on the third attempt there from Manchester. What a run there. What a run. Absolutely I mean, weaving between every single uh, possible player there. Looks to be a bit, been a flag at the end, but it possibly for excessive celebration. So I believe the touchdown is probably still going to stand. Uh, 
Now this is the kind of exciting football we've been looking for. Well, the third time of kicking it, third time of asking, Tamworth did ask them to kick that for the third time, and that really paid off, actually. That's a great coaching call there. They knew what they wanted to do, it seemed. Want to stretch that field out, split the players up, look for those gaps. Great run. We all love a special teams touchdown, to be fair. Looks to have been a couple of penalties there after the touchdown from Tamworth from both the uh, on field player and the sideline. Extra point coming up for Tamworth, will they look to get the two? And the extra point is good. It's going to make it 10 to Tamworth, uh, 3 to Manchester, uh, 7 to Manchester. And a very deep kickoff now coming from Tamworth. Similar sort of situation to put Manchester in. Following time with score, we have the kickoff. Let's see what Manchester can do with the ball. And a catch by Max Gracie Ainscuff. He's going to try and return it. Takes it into the middle of the field at about the 38.
The ball snapped to Sam Bloomfield and hand off to Joe Nicholson. Makes the run down the middle. Looks to have made about four, yard, four or five yards. Possibly an equipment issue here. And then comes snapping the ball, we got Matt McCormick. a low snap but he still managed to complete the pass and make the first down it's a low snap there well recovered there from Bloomfield always teething issues when you bring a new centre in Must be a run from Joe Nicholson. He's got blockers in front of him as well. And that looks like first down as well. Great run in there. Yeah, big men moving there. Some of the O liners getting all the way down to Fenham lead blocks. Titans first down from the 20, just inside the end zone. They hand it off to Joe Nicholson, who seems to hit a wall of people. And the rest blow it dead. Yeah. <laughs> Looks to have picked up uh, no yards there, I think. to have given him a yard there, it's going to be second and nine. Manchester coach is looking to have a quick conversation with the rest here regarding something. Just a quick opportunity to get one of our sponsors back in there again. That's the Home Improvement Group, serving thousands of customers with their home transformation dreams, from doors and windows to conservatories, roof rooms, and more. And here we have second and nine from Manchester, from the 19. Oh, it's to be a shovel out to Joe Nick. He's caught inside, he's still going, he's still on his feet. That's a touchdown! What a run after contact! Fantastic run in there from the Manchester side. I would have said nearly all of those yards that he picked up there were after some contact. Great running, great drive. Very strong running from Joe Nicholson there. Coming out of UCLan after a shovel pass from Sam Bloomfield, also out of UCLan and uh, most recent season's head coach of UCLan.
And the extra point here for Aaron Bokoff. Looks to be good, and the rest have signalled it good. 14-10 to Manchester. Well, just as predicted, actually, from half-time there, who was going to blink first? It looks like both these teams are really starting to open up now. I think both of us started with our eyes closed. <laughs> Real test in that first half. Now we're really seeing some, some stretching of the legs from both offensive units. There's concern for a minute we may have more turnovers than points this game. from Bocart and it's gone low and he's returning it oh and he managed to get through two tackles and he just seemed to have run right behind Alex Cooper there and there Flags we go are plenty. tackle Let's see what the result of those flags was. The first bit three. Looks to be a holding actually. Holding on the return to be on the returning team. And another. Be first down Tamworth, but with a bit extra on that. Let's see what Angus and this uh, Tamworth offence can do now. Takes the snap, clean snap. He's looking for the pass, he throws deep. Oh, and it's broken up. Broken up by number one, uh, Ricky Delver. Great Fantastic speed. route run. Pinpoint accuracy. It's a snap and a hand off and it's the run left. <laughs> Looks to have been tackled in the uh, after the line of scrimmage. He's looking deep again. And he's gone over the player there. He'll need to start connecting on these passes if they want to make any mo any movement downfield. Does look like they're trying it a lot more though. A lot stronger uh, pass uh, presence in the second half from Tamworth. In comes Max, the returner for Manchester. 
as we go to special teams on punt with Tamworth. Flag down. Possibly a delay of game. Second attempt by Tamworth here for the uh, the punt. Being spoiled for special teams here. Maybe not every attempt is uh, or even starting, but. Oh, it's a high snap for the punter. And it'll. And that seems to have gone out around the halfway line. Good recovery there from the punter. But for a second there, the uh, defensive lineman may have touched the punt and made the ball uh, legal for the Phoenix to pick up there. little look at the uh, Titans defense here. Head coach Jonathan Homer giving uh, some words of wisdom. And the ball snapped to Sam Bloomfield. And he's looking for the pass outside. And that seems to have been collected by Chris Rinro. Great collection. Uh, it looks to have taken about seven yards out. Looks like running back Tyler Brown is down. Oh, no, wait, is that Joe Nick? Joe Nicholson, yeah. Joe Nicholson down again. Refs are blown for an injury timeout. As the medic makes his way over to Joe eventually. Seemed to be uh, at a sauntering pace there. couple of uh, arms from the medic and his uh, fellow colleague Sam Bloomfield. He's back on his feet. Possibly just some uh, contact pain. Yeah, good to see him back on his feet, walking it off. Injury timeout. It looks like time has resumed. There we go. And we're back on. John Gago in at running back in place of uh, Joe Nicholson. Very strong runner, John. Spanish international player. Moving the ball, maybe made a yard.
Yeah, real solid runner, uh, Johnny Pangargo. And we have a third and two from Manchester. Can they make these extra yards? That's an incomplete pass to the left. Just rocketed over his head there. Looks like Manchester are going to keep their offense out on the field here. They're going to go for it. In the Here spread again. Here we have fourth down. Both back. It's another pass. And the ref is running that incomplete. That's going to be a turnover and down to ball. Yeah, really shot down on that corner there. With only two yards to go, you might have thought. I guess uh, they were thinking, Tom was thinking the same. Angus and the uh, Town of Phoenix take the field. We have a first down around 28. Yeah, still in that two back set that they really like to show here. Great pass break up there from uh, Sam Fossey. Yeah, Sam Fossey there, current uh, GB. Uh, he's also played for the Treasure Coast Bengals in Florida. Uh, notably won the national championship in London uh, for the Warriors in 2013. He's made a long trip up north and has settled in Manchester. And settled he has, what a fantastic. Second down, 10 yards to go. Looking like some heavy blitz is possibly coming. And run through the middle, he skipped one. Made his way past, but couldn't beat the three men making the tackle. Great strong run in, though. Broken plenty of tackles today. Yeah, great grit shown there to pick up some important yards, leaving a third and middle. Come with running back uh, Wellington to Theory. Oh, the running backs have left Angus on his own. Something different here from Tamworth. Oh, big hit from Ola. Ola Baju. What a hit. And he's mixing it up. It's all about Baju, yeah. Um, made everyone but me Jalof Rice today. Uh, not about that. We'll be having words at the end of the game. Hopefully he's got me a ball in there. Oh, so he should have. Ball is snapped to the punter. Punt's clean. And Tamworth have stopped that on the one. What a kick. Very well done from the Tamworth special teams there. I've pinned Manchester right back. Didn't want to touch that one. I mean, again, you're swarmed by Tamworth special teams players. It's been made. Very well drilled team. Very well drilled special teams.
Adam Bamber in motion. Taking the snap in his own, own end zone here, Sam. Bluefield, he hands it off. He makes it over the line of scrimmage, which is probably one of the most important things. Yeah, probably just trying to get himself some uh, space for a decent snap. be uh, second in from the third yard line. Another handoff down the middle. Just making it out of the end zone. Yeah, third and long here. In your own end zone, this is really not where you want to be. See if Manchester can get out of this, this situation here. That's a pass complete to Adam Bamba. He looks to have made the first down as well. Good resilience there from the uh, Manchester offence. Real pressure stuff there. Strong, strong pressure there from Tamworth. They were looking for those extra points from the safety. Fresh set of downs for Manchester. Still not great field position, but uh, <laughs> nowhere near as bad as it was. That looks to be a run there. Uh, the new running back in there, uh, Adam Newton there for Manchester. Yeah, between plays there, head coach Jonathan Homer has just run off the pitch. I think he needs a quick toilet break. We'll see how they can cope without the, uh, the head coach down there. Chris Rimro in motion, looks to be a jet sweep. Oh, and he's made the cut on the inside after that big cut tackle. And he's still going downfield. Good run in there from the uh, wide receiver on the motion. Number 14, Chris Rimro, uh, current GB player. Coming out of uh, Leeds Beckett University. It's off for the Titans, They're looking to do some bobs this half. Game's going to be far from over. He's gone deep with the ball there. Some of the Titans are looking for a flag there. Um, I'm going to call that a clean though Second and ten for Manchester with a handoff to Adam Newton. Very strong run of the ball, Adam. Oh, he looks to have come out. Tamworth have come up with the ball. It looks to be a turnover. Tamworth ball. It was a really cost. There with the knee down that there, just it's a second fumble now that's been recovered.
And that brings on the uh, Tamworth offence. To have brought in a new quarterback. And with a hand off to the running back. He's looking to have made about five yards there. Very strong running from Tamworth. New Tamworth quarterback is uh, number 10. His name is, uh, I'll just find it now, Josh Osbrook. I believe coming out of uh, SGS Pride down in Bristol, if I remember rightly. Don't have the notes for that though. And we have a handoff and he's still going. Manchester defence don't want to let him get any more than that though. Yeah, Sam Fassi with a big tackle there. Showing off his... Uh, PT muscles. <laughs> Check out <laughs> Sam Fossey PT. He's not sponsored, it's just him. Here we have third and five. Looking to pass and he's throwing deep. Broken up there by the uh, Titans defense. Yeah, first uh, look at some passing plays there by Josh Oldsbrook. Looking to go deep straight away. Looking very accurate with those passes. Known as a deep ball thrower. Broken up there by uh, Manchester's number one, uh, Ricky Delver. But it looks like he's down at the moment. That's Ricky Delver actually um, coming up through the Highland University JUCO system well, in the States. Uh, been playing with us for a fair few years now, though. Possibly one of the fastest players out on the field with a 40-yard uh, time of uh, Fourth down now for Tamworth. And they just made it to about the uh, first down marker. Yeah, unfortunately, that was a five yard punt by the end of it. Um, bounce on Very the kick there. unfortunate bounce. Special teams for Tamworth have been so effective. That's just unfortunate today. And that's to be the end of the third quarter. Titans offense out. See what they can do with the ball. 15 minutes left. Titans are 12. Up. We don't play 15 minute quarters. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Looks to be another run uh, for a gain of zero yard. <laughs> 15, we might stop in the first quarter. I thought it was going quickly. Obviously, okay, I didn't does work. Let's see. 
Titans changing the call. Ball's come out, it's handed off again to Adam Newton. Very strong running. Needs to keep hold of that ball this time, and he does. And he is a fraction away from that first down marker. It could only be inches. Are they moving? Ooh. From where they've spotted the ball. Um, it is a first down. It is a first down. Maybe I was wrong. We do play for 15 minute quarters. Might be 12 left now. <laughs> and it's uh, out to Adam Newton for more yards. Still going. Strong yards. Did well to keep his feet in bounds. It's a second look at the speed option there. Tyler Brown in at running back with a motion. Sam looking to pass it deep. Oh, very well broken up there by the Tamworth DBs. And change up wide receiver there. Dan Hayward's come in. I think we might have an injury there. Possibly getting the name wrong on the running back. Uh, might even be Ryan Newton, his brother. <laughs> kind of difficult to wear in 25 and 26. Oh, Chris Rinrose pulled up there with a. So it seems to be an issue with his leg. He was looking for that catch. Dan Haywood making his way in for the injured Chris Winrow. Seems to be just sauntering off at the air. John Gago back in at running back. Pass from Sam Bluefield is complete to Dan Haywood. And that's a touchdown in the end zone. What a touchdown. He waited and he was precise with the pass from Sam. And that's going to put the uh, Titans up by over a score now. And this put Manchester up 21-10. That's a bad snap. And the kicker's just going to die on it. And it will stay at 20 points to 10.
Ah, scoreboard manager DK here. Very up. He wasn't able to complete his job. Uh, it seems to have been updated by uh, another member of the sideline. That's a kick from Aaron. It's gone deep. And they have done the handoff this time. It's a reverse on that. And didn't work as well this time. It's down at the 10. We see another look from the special teams of Tamworth, though. They seem to have a deeper playbook on special Tamworth we'll have the ball here, first and turn at the 11-yard uh, line. It's handed off as an inside run. He's looked to make some yards. Still moving. The refs have finally blown it dead. Gain about three or four yards there. Very strong there from the offense. Oh, flags. Which Looks like there is a flag on the field, though. Unsportsmanlike conduct on the offense. Second down. Do we know what it was? Not a clue. Ball is snapped and he's looking deep again with that very tasty deep ball. And that's going to be incomplete. And we have flags being thrown. Pass interference. PI from both teams. <laughs> Either way, we're back at the 10. I see what this uh, Titans defense can do. They can hold up this uh, Tamworth offense as he throws the ball deep again. It's incomplete. He'll have one more try from the 10 yard line. A lot of deep balls coming in now from Tamworth. Complete change of game plan from them. Probably thinking about that five-yard punt they had. They really want to get out, out of their own half right now. Could definitely do with not one of those again.
He's looking deep again. Is he going to go? He's passed it. And it's a completion. Fantastic reception there by that guy. Number 87. Number 87. I have notes on Tamworth. Uh, yep, yeah, that's Chris. Uh, Chris. Well, some of you will uh, recognise that name. Quite well known. Very talented receiver, and he looks to be a run down the middle. Must have made about five yards there. We have a second and four here. QB's looking to pass again. He throws the ball and it's completion. As he's taken out of bounds, big hit from Ricky. Hits don't really matter though when the completions are coming in. Yeah, he's really starting to roll now. Getting comfortable this QB. Looking like this game could very much well come down to the wire. Yeah, Josh Oldsbrook here. Looks like the threat now with the with the pass. Uh, Ron was established in the first half. Let's see if they uh, get that back again. Ball's come out and it looks like he's going to try and run it. And he's made the first down, but there is a flag in the backfield. And there's going to be a holding penalty. Couldn't exactly make out the decision there. I think they're going to replay the down. Yeah, that's demoralising there for Josh Ellsbrook and this offence. Uh, going backwards after a great play like that. He's going to dig deep now. Looks to be about first and 20. He looks to pass the ball. Big hit from Sam Fossey, but he doesn't go down. Wow. What strength to stay stood up. Very well to stay on his feet there. That's what Sam Fossey's known for. Those massive hits on the strong safety. Looking to pass deep. Looks to have made about five yards there. It takes to like third and 15. I know Joe Partington, the uh, defensive friend, salivates at these situations. Then along from Tamworth. Steps out. Looks to be being chased down by the defence here. And is that, no, looks to be uh, blown dead by the referee. And that is a hustle play there by Connor Hewitt, number 93, the big nose tackle. Big guy there that's, making the moves. That's big man moving fast right there. I have his official 40 time here as still running it, but what an athletic performance there. I'm sure we'll get an update by uh, next season.
So the special teams are going to be coming out now. It's going to be 4th and 22. Now I'm an optimist and uh, I do like a good fake on special teams. 22 yards to go. It, uh, I think they're just going to punt this. Snap goes back, the punt is clean. And they're going to let it run back for a touchback. Tamworth aren't happy, but I believe that was a completely legal hit. It was Alex Eager on the hit there. Really not letting up, really not letting up here from the Manchester Titans. Tam would seem to think if uh, Manchester have let it go, that that's the end of the play. Play to the whistle. And keep your head on a swivel. Manchester first down on the 20. Snap's good, handoff is clean, and he's been shut down. Made possibly a yard and a half. <laughs> Second and nine for Titans. See if Tamworth can keep this defensive pressure up. It's looking for the pass. And that's complete. Good pass, good completion. With ben Martin there. One of the other fastest players on the uh, Titans team. And the chains are moved. Don't believe I have a uh, 40 time for him though, unfortunately. I'll tell you this, he's uh, very quick. Titans going to run it, and he's got open field. Great run in there. Great running from Newton. And here we go with another first down. Sam's passed it, and that's complete to Max. We do have a Phoenix player down. Seems to be sat up. He's on his feet now. Titans decided to go uh, very quick here with the uh, the offense. And it's going to be a timeout, Tamworth. Yeah, club called that timeout, actually. Um, just to slow that game down, it was getting a little bit too quick with that horrible offense.
And that's the time out over with. Deep into the end zone now. The shift from Adam. And that's a, another handoff to Newton. Big strong runner. Just crosses the line of scrimmage there. Maybe a yard. I'm sure he would have wanted much more than that. Handed off to Newton. He's going to get some yards. They found a way through that wall of defensive linemen there. Third and goal. Well, Manchester are ready to go already. Lots of pressure now in this uh, the shred zone attempt. Ooh, and that's an incomplete pass. A lot of pressure on the QB. You know, what a get off there by number four is that? Just getting the binoculars out. Titans with the fourth down. They're going for it. Sam Bloomfield spotted the gap there and he uh, threw the ball straight into Ben Martin's hand for the reception and the touchdown. He's going to put Manchester on to 26, uh, pending the extra point. Yeah, momentum really kept with Manchester during that drive. There was a great pace and tempo to their offence and it paid off. And this is a play. <laughs> the extra point is no good. And we have a Tamworth player down in the middle of the field. Well, the extra point was no good for the Titans, but very good for look, watching. Look, look. And we'll have a brief pause now for a Tamworth player on the ground. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure the coach should be pulling a player like that. And I believe that's Jason Scott. That is not behaviour becoming of a uh, GB head coach. Quick message from our sponsor, Synergy Direct, kit sponsor for the Titans. UK's leading renewable energy installer, specializing in the design and installation of solar panels, solar battery storage, and air source heat pumps. Thank you very much, Synergy Direct. with a low kick from Aaron Bocock. Possibly avoiding uh, putting the ball into the uh, returners of Tamworth. 
Possibly a smart idea, seemed very athletic. First down from Tamworth. That's, that's unfortunate from number 84. Right in the breadbasket. Good option to get free there by the wide receiver. Um, could have been some really important yards. And it's a handoff and an inside run. The lead blocker was making it downfield pretty well, but uh, fortunately the running back wasn't behind him. You love to see it. Big guys moving. Tamworth player down. Uh, number 77 for Tamworth, Joe Bull currently down in midfield. Hopefully it's nothing too serious. And we'll have another quick message from our sponsor, State Signed. For all your signed NFL memorabilia, sourced, shipped and supplied, that's State Signed. Beautiful man, David Booker. Incredible bird game. Just taking a minute here whilst the uh, the medics have a chance to look at the uh, Tamworth Phoenix play.
See, the time with fire is uh, fully moving. It's just uh, it seems to be taking a while. An injury to the foot, possibly. Yeah, helmet's off, so must be something really serious. But all the best. And he looks to be back on his feet now. He's taken over the sideline, but uh, unfortunately, I think his day, um, his game's coming to an end. Yeah, get well soon for that guy. It looked like a pretty serious uh, injury, probably to the ankle or the foot. back to your uh, regularly scheduled programming. Football. 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 <laughs> and the third down, third and about eight. Tamworth now um, missing possibly one of their uh, offensive linemen. He goes deep. And Ricky breaks that off in fantastic fashion. Unfortunate not to get the pick, I think. I'll take us to fourth down. Uh, fourth and about nine. I'm glad you're keeping up with the downs there. If time we want anything out of this game, uh, uh, we're going to have to go for it. No special teams on this play. And the QB's look, looking to use his legs. And he's looking like he's made the first down. Chased down by Fossey as he uh, makes his way out of bounds to, in order to avoid the uh, steam train that was coming in. Another fresh set of downs for Tamworth. He's looking deep. He throws the pass to an open man. Alex E with the tackle, but great pass, great completion. That's going to pin them right in the end zone. Yeah, in the red zone. Fantastic yardage there. Really in a threatening position now. Swap of personnel. Ibi Mohammed coming out for uh, Connor Hewitt, much larger stature of him. Yeah, Connor was the uh, nose tackle that got the sack earlier on in the game. The ball has come loose, and I don't know who's got it. I don't know who's got it. We'll wait for the referee. Titans are very happy about it. <laughs> and he's come away with the ball. Mark Horton. And let's be honest right here, this game has been decided by special teams and fumble recoveries today. A real tightly fought game, both, both sides really in it until the end, but fumbles and recoveries are really, really costing both teams now. Another former, uh, former Merseyside player, uh, Mark Rio Horton. 
very strong middle linebacker. Coached at Liverpool last season, um, Liverpool University last season. And a quick check out of the uh, turnover chain celebrations by the defence there. Yeah, there's one thing this Titans team know how to do, it is how to party. And we're back off. Well, that was loud. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure what happened there. It sounded like a fire alarm went off. Sam Bloomfield looks deep. Adam Bamba with the reception. What and reception. he's going to take it to the end zone. As he points at the scoreboard for our scoreboard manager, be, GK, to update. That's got to be, eight, what, 75, 80 yards? They were not that long, probably 60. We're on a short pitch here. <laughs> Fantastic from Manchester there. In a quiet game for uh, Aaron Bocott though, he's probably really well hoping for some uh, points after here. No, it looks like Manchester are going to go for two. Manchester are going to go for two. Ooh, and it's incomplete. I 
that took the game at 32 to 10 to Manchester. Uh, and after a first half of 3-0, uh, the second half has definitely been a welcome change. Quick time to talk about a sponsorship as well. Uh, SWS are the complete package when it comes to green technologies, offering a range of services from home and commercial renewable installations, including air source, solar panel, battery storage systems, and electric vehicle charging points. Thank you very much, SWS. And the kick's gone out. They're going to make Manchester kick it again. <laughs> Rough day at the office here for Aaron Bocock. Tom was looking to make Manchester take the kick again. Well, it worked for him before. Yeah, have you seen what her name is? The sister. And we'll have another go. Aaron's keeping it low this time. Oh. And he seems to have run into the back of his own player there. That was a big hit from 87. That's George Slade. GB flag player. Well, this isn't flag anymore. That was a huge hit. <laughs> First and 10 for Tamworth. That's a completion, but then a big hit from Sam Fossey. Looks to have uh, made a gain of a yard there. I think that's like the third or the fourth massive hit for Sam Fossey. Uh, GB strong safety there. second down it looks like the QB is going to run this time what a reach there by number six Calvin Wong and we have a play down in the backfield that's good to see Connor Hewitt's back on his feet now Although he's struggling. He might just have uh, got himself off early there to eat some jollof rice. I wouldn't blame him. Looks like Josh Osbrook's make, looking to make a run and the ball's flumped out. The refs have blown the whistle dead though. <laughs> Some of the uh, Titan sideline pointing forward, but uh, fortunately I think it was blown dead before that.
pass it out. <laughs> Empty backfield. He's looking to pass. He's looking to scramble. He's being chased by Alfred. Possibly thrown. No, nope, yeah. No, he wasn't. Great was yardage on a broken down play. Great pass there. Great reception, but that looks to be the final whistle. Manchester Titans beating Tamworth Phoenix 32 to 10. Great win. Out schemed them. Well, it seemed to me that quite a lot of people had Tamworth pegged as quite a comfortable win here. Strong statement from the North, particularly these two teams battling it out for that Northern supremacy. It looks cool. to me like the Titans could possibly take this division. Ooh, I like that. Uh, yeah, I believe uh, many people had this game pegged as a uh, Phoenix win. I think uh, the main journalism platform, I guess, uh, Sport Tank, had uh, all three of their guys voting for Tamworth to win this game, but uh, Titans have come out on top. 32-10 winners. Massive statement from Manchester. When can we see you again, Manny? Uh, you can see me again on Manchester Titans' next home game. Uh, still a while away, though. Um, just going to check our dates. Uh, yeah, we have a game versus Scalmersdale Nighthawks on uh, Sunday the 15th of May uh, in Bellevue, Manchester. I'm sure tickets will be available for that. Uh, but the next game for both of these teams, we have uh, Manchester face off in Sheffield against the Sheffield Giants on the 1st of May and Tamworth head over to Skelmersdale to face off against the Nighthawks. Uh, sure, both sure to be a big game, but uh, after seeing this match, I think there's only going to be one winners in both of those. Thank you very much for joining us today and I really hope you've enjoyed uh, the show we put on for you. Yeah, thanks everyone who made it to the stadium and to the almost 500 people watching or live. Fantastic support. Thank you very much.